got another uh, locomotive to test, possibly repair, at least have to do a tune-up. As you can see, I've still got several to get caught up with, so normally I wouldn't do so many in one day. This is the third one today. Um, but, um, yeah, let's open it up and see what we got here. I don't know if you notice what I'm noticing right off the bat. It's a little bit suspect. So we're going to see what we end up with. Because this is gold colored. This is a silver or grayish color. They should not be two different colors. Somebody's done some repairs already. So uh, let me finish getting these screws out and uh, we'll see what's going on inside. Also, I haven't taken this other screw out yet, but there's a lot of rattling inside there. It might just be the windows. We'll find out. Alright, let's see what we've got in here. windows, there's the cap, that lead piece seems to be pretty solid right there, there you go, Let's see if it wants to do anything, it's pretty corroded right there, so I don't know if I can get too much juice to it or not. And it runs. Doesn't even sound too loud either, without any lubricating or nothing. I guess uh, maybe they um, repaired it pretty well. well. We'll find out when we look inside here. I don't know. Should be an all-wheel drive. We might get this open, and then I might only be four-wheel drive. All right, there you go. I've uh, cleaned it up. We installed the lenses, glued, re-glued in the lenses in the front and back. Thought you'd want to look inside and see it's pretty darn clean in there. Needs a bit of lubrication. Put a tiny bit of grease and some oil. Clean up the wheels and it's going to be a runner. Let it run a little bit there while I clean the wheels, right? Alright, it's been all cleaned and lubed up. Let's put it on the track.